Yes, Alex, that program should begin any minute now. And as you just mentioned, of course, Officer Chad Swanson was beloved in this area. He was just a great guy. People looked up to him. He had a lifetime of service, which sadly was shut court, was, was cut short. Um, we are going to look at some video from earlier today images of Officer Swanson, a, a devastating loss to this community. Now, he was a 13-year member of the Manhattan Beach Police Department. This evening, the community is gathering here. I'm keeping my voice down at a low rate because, of course, people here are gathered in tribute, in mourning, um, speaking in hushed tones. As I look around the room, I see people from the Manhattan Beach Police Department, also from Hawthorne, and I'm sure that there are other departments here that are represented. Um, I believe there are also just regular folks from the community who wanted to come and say thank you to this man for his lifetime of service. Um, you know, you have to almost be here to get the feeling that is taking place outside right now. Um, I see one woman in a wheelchair and others have brought children with them. They really wanted to say thank you to this man, who was a true hero. If some of you know his backstory, he survived the Vegas mass shooting, and he went to administer aid to a woman nearby who was bleeding. He was able to gather something together to create a tourniquet and apply pressure and then carry her to safety. And when you talk to people, that is the way that they describe him, as a man of service, a heroic man. Um, I can tell you that after they do the service here, they will then make a walk out to the pier. It should take about eight minutes if we're walking at just a regular speed. And once they get to the pier, the tribute will continue. They are going to have some type of light there that will light up in blue in tribute to his service to the police department. But right now here, uh, a somber mood, a reverential mood, if you will. And we will continue to cover this story here on Fox 11 of a man who lived his life with dignity, with service, who was heroic. I'm Laura Diaz reporting live from Manhattan Beach.